This is a quicker video on how to create descriptive link in Brightspace. Now, the purpose of descriptive links, as you can see, is to make navigation easy for someone who will not be able to really see. And um, having that self-explanatory description of the link helps students to understand it. So how do we do that? Now, in Brightspace, I'm going to use this example. You created this particular content here, but for more information, you did include a whole URL. So to change this particular URL to become a descriptive link, what you do, uh, you have to do is you click in it, you will copy these links. Copy, and you can either go ahead and cut it out. That means you can use and say you want to take it out of there. So I'm cutting it. Now, instead of putting that there, what you can do, you can change it to, for more information, I uh, you say, for more information, visit the student policy website. And the student policy website, you highlight it, you go to link, insert quick links, and you, of course, look for the URL which is all the way to the back here, you click on URL, you input or you paste it down here. Right click, paste the link, and you want it to be open as a window on its own, and you say insert. So you could see that the link changed from a URL to what we call descriptive links. And you update, and the link is down there. So this is how you create a descriptive link.